Today, we're going to look at Java Exotics VLOX 12 volt coffee and espresso brewer. First, remove the top. Then take out the top filter screen. Then the filter cylinder. Now you can see the inside of the VLOX. This is a water reservoir, which holds the water for the brewing process. Pour water into the reservoir, filling it to within half an inch off the top, which will allow room for the filter cylinder. Now place the filter cylinder back into the VLOX. Then place a flat filter disc at the bottom of the filter cylinder. Next, pour your ground coffee into the filter basket on top of the flat filter disc. Your coffee should be ground so that it's not too fine to get through the filter. We grind our coffee on setting number two, which is one up from fine espresso. You should adjust your grind to your liking and the type of coffee used. Place enough coffee in, but not so much that the top filter disc does not sit even with the top of the filter cylinder. Be careful not to press the coffee down too hard, it should be slightly loose. Screw the top of the VLOX down, but not too tightly, it should be snug. In this configuration, the coffee will be brewed directly into the built-in cup at the bottom of the VLOX. A second configuration is screw the top back on with the brewing nozzle positioned to the side. This way you can brew directly into a cup of your choosing. To brew, plug your VLOX into your cigarette lighter with the included 12 volt cord. Make sure the cord is in snugly on both ends. At first, you will not hear or see anything, but you will feel a slight warmth through the VLOX. After a few minutes, your coffee will suddenly begin to brew into the lower cup, and you will soon hear a gurgling sound and then silence, which will alert you that it has completed. Be careful, though, the coffee will be piping hot, but it will be delicious. Cheers!